Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we're making Dan Dan noodles, a spicy noodle dish originating from Sichuan province in China. There are so, so many variations of this dish, but the version I'm sharing today simplifies the recipe, omitting the Sichuan mustard greens, which can be difficult to buy outside of China. Let's start by breaking down Dan Dan noodles into two components the mincemeat topping, and the sauce. For the sauce, two key ingredients are peppercorns and chili oil. Red peppercorns are the standard type to use, but I'm subbing them with green ones today because this was the only one I could find at the market. Peppercorns bring the classic lip mouth numbing sensation that's common in many citron dishes. Chili oil is what brings the standard heat that you're probably familiar with. It's savory, smoky, and earthy. You can use any type of chili oil or even make your own. I'm using store-bought chili oil and I like to mix it with spicy chili crisp for extra spice and texture. We're going to start by preparing the sauce for the minced meat. Add the dark soy sauce, Chinese cooking wine, and oyster sauce together. Heat up your wok or pan on medium to medium high heat. Once the wok is hot, pour in one tablespoon cooking oil of your choice. Once the oil is hot, add in your minced meat and star anise. Stir the mince around and make sure to break it up into tiny bits. Once the mince turns brown, add in your sauce mixture, minced ginger, and chopped up white parts of the green onion. Give everything a good mix and turn the heat down to medium. Let the meat cook through for roughly three to four minutes stirring occasionally. We're drying out the mince and letting all the water evaporate. The final texture should be slightly crispy, adding another layer of texture to the noodles. Once the minced meat is done, set it aside. We're going to cook our noodles now. I'm using fresh sliced noodles that I picked up from the Chinese supermarket. You can often find noodles labeled as dan dan noodles at Chinese supermarkets, but any type of thin wheat noodles will work. I'm going to cook them according to the instructions on the package. While our noodles are cooking, we're going to start working on the sauce. Start by heating a pan on medium heat and add in a few handfuls of peppercorn. We're going to toast the peppercorns to bring out their flavor. This will take a few minutes and make sure to stir them around periodically so they don't burn. Once the peppercorns become fragrant, turn off the heat. Finally crush the peppercorns into a powder either with a mortar, pestle, or a rolling pin. Set that aside for later use. In a bowl, add in your sesame paste light soy sauce, sugar, Chinese vinegar, peppercorn powder, chili oil, one to two spoonfuls of water or chicken broth, and a pinch of salt. Mix everything together until the sesame paste is completely dissolved. To plate, we're going to add our noodles directly into the sauce bowl. I also blanched a few pieces of bok choy to top off my noodles. You can substitute this with vegetables of your choice or skip this step completely. To my noodles, I'm adding a couple spoonfuls of the minced meat mixture. Finally, I'm adding some finely chopped green onions, peanut crumbles, and a nice chili oil drizzle. Give the noodles a good mix and they're ready to eat. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe and make sure to subscribe if you're not already. I'll see you in the next video.